Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So of course today's video is going to be a little bit different. We are going to be talking about 2017 and reflecting on some important things that happened this year. So of course, as you guys know, it is December 31st as this video is going up, which is New Year's Eve. And yeah, we are going into 2018 pretty soon here. And 2017 was a very very good year for my channel but before we get into talking about this year and all the good parts and stuff I enjoyed for the channel I just do want to apologize because I was thinking about doing a Christmas special and while I was gone to California which was that was a, by the way that was a really fun trip I definitely enjoyed it and of course now I am back but anyways I was gonna try and get a Christmas special out but I just didn't I just didn't have any ideas this year, so I do apologize for that, but I'll probably do a Christmas special for 2018, since the last one I did was 2016 Christmas. And I was going to do a, an Adventures from Radiator Springs episode as well, but that kind of fell through. So I'm just kind of tired of, you know, saying I'm going to film an episode and then like the next week I never even end up doing it. or releasing it so today I don't know how I did this but today I pre-recorded like three episodes so continuously for the next three Saturdays I will have all episodes done so basically just for the next three weeks so that's really cool I'm glad I got all that done because I don't know the procrastination has been real with me lately I've just been really really lazy so I just do want to apologize for that so let's go ahead and get into this 2017 conclusion. So I know this background is a little easy, but I do have a couple next gen races here. We've got Bubba and Chase in the back, and we've also got Tim and Ryan, if you, you know, kind of move right a little bit. And then we've got all the townies. So I decided thought I'd make it, you know, a little bit simple. So 2017 was a really good year for my channel because you guys gave me a lot, and I mean a lot of support, and I just want to thank you, thank you, thank you for that because my channel would not be where it's at if it wasn't for you guys. Well, obviously it wouldn't be where it's at if it wasn't for you guys because just my channel has grown a lot, and you know, I just remember when I first hit 100 subscribers and also 50, like I was just so so excited and now we're already at almost 5,000 which we should be hitting maybe in the next month or two or so but we will see about that and I definitely will in 2018 whenever I do hit 5,000 subscribers no doubt I will make a, sub a special I did not make one for 4,000 I believe I did make a live stream for 2,000 but that was the last time I ever celebrated a live uh not a live stream a milestone so 5,000 should be a good, a good, you know, number of subscribers that I should definitely celebrate because I may do like some type of Q&A or something, but in the comments, in the comment section below, tell me your thoughts on what I should do for 5,000 subscribers special because I'm not really sure. I have a couple ideas, but I don't know. I kind of think it should be the influence of you guys so just tell me your thoughts in the comment section below only if you would like to I remember all the way back like the first couple months of 2017 when like the main line was coming out you know there was only a couple new cars and then after that cars 3 releases started coming on May 1st that was such a big day for cars collectors man I was psyched for that day but the thing is there was nothing even there on May 1st in my stores at least there's nothing there so my grandma back like she lives in California and she like found all of the stuff released on May 1st and then brought it later that month to me so I thanked her a lot for that and that was just amazing and eventually like further in the month of May they started showing up in my stores and yeah car series releases were are just great I'm so glad that there will be the 2018 main line that should be that is, you know, coming up, you know, it's being released, the cars are being released in some places, and I think that is amazing, and I'm really looking forward to getting some of the Cars 3 Radiator Springs classics as well, you know, like Scott Tiller, Intro Ramon, Sally with Tattoo, Primer Line McQueen as a single, not in the 11 pack, because I see that so much, and I'm just like, no, I'm going to wait for Primer Line McQueen as a single, so... Yeah, definitely, this year was very big for Cars collectors, since Cars 3 came out, and all the Cars 3 releases, all the big ones at least, and that is 
really cool. And speaking of that, I only need three more singles to complete all of the diecast that were released this year for Cars 3. So that would be Junior Moon, Louise Nash, and River Scott. I was kind of blanking out on, the, on River Scott's name for a second, but yeah, so I should be getting those soon. And I have a lot more reviews coming for 2018 as well. I mean, I've got reviews of Chris Revstopsky, we've got Rusty's Cruz Ramirez, Intro Light McQueen, uh, Precision Series Flow, Phil Tankson, Precision Series Fillmore, I believe, and I think there's a couple more I'm forgetting, but you guys get the idea. There will be many more reviews to come in 2018, and it definitely will be a pretty big year as well, since the main line will be coming out with casts from the first, second, and third movie. I thought they'd wait till like 2019 to do that, but nope, 2018 sooner, definitely sooner than I thought. But that's really cool. So many really cool releases coming up soon, and definitely uh, I will try to get a lot more frequent Adventures from Raiders Springs episode episodes, unboxing reviews, and of course. I know there are still suggestion re reviews from months ago that I still haven't reviewed, guys, and I do apologize for that, but I will try to get most of them done in January, because I know that I still have them in my in the notes app on my phone, because that's where I store all of my suggestions with the name of the suggestor, uh, suggestor and what they suggested, so... I know I'm kind of rambling a little bit, so I do apologize for that, and I do want to make this short, so... That will pretty much do it for the for my 2017 conclusion. And I do hope you guys had a great 2017 and a great Christmas. Great Hanukkah, great everything. Because this 2017 was definitely a great year for me. And I hope it was a great year for you. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. We will see you guys for another great year of Cars Reviews 2018. Peace out.